Hello, Crazy Surfer here. What the heck is going on? It looks like I'm finished. Let's back this up a little bit and see what just happened. This was me finishing up a session from Hurricane Iasis, I think was the name. But let's go back to the beginning. When I paddled out at around 4.50 a.m. to see how scared I could actually make myself and it went pretty well. This was my first wave at about 5.07 a.m. Yeah, it was still pretty dark out there. But the GoPro caught the wave and looky there, I caught a wave in the dark. Not bad. I love doing things like this so that I can say 385 dog years old really isn't that old. If you can surf in the dark, you're still young. The bad part about surfing in the dark is when you're paddling out and you can't see the wave coming and you have to bail out into dark shark infested water. I tell you, when you come up, you are back on your board in no time. Here are a couple of the waves from this morning. Much better waves I could see. Very, very fun waves. Iasis was a pretty good hurricane. The next couple of waves you'll see me on Moby Dick, my Hobie Monster 11 foot 4 inch thick surfboard. On the first wave, I take off going left and I turn this beast all the way around and start to go right. Let me tell you, that is a lot of work, taking that thing all the way around. Most of my friends who ride it can't even turn it. This is a heck of a long left. I took off way outside. I was just cruising on the outside little swell. It walls up at the end and munches me for lunch. Kaboom! Down he goes. The next two waves are my waves from Hurricane Epsilon. I was up north all winter doing the fall colors. We got back on a Saturday. And that Sunday was the day in Melbourne. I'll tell you what, the waves were eight to 10 feet. Sets coming in about every 15 minutes. And I surfed for three and a half hours. This is the cleanups on that last Monday. This is a great backside ripper. Go back up to the top, down, come over, hit the collapsing lip, and do one of the best backside hits I've done in quite some time. Again, great for 385 dog years old. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.